What's going on guys? Tonight's video we are going to be unboxing and reviewing this guy right here. Now you probably are wondering what's inside that box. This is going to be a camping LED light which is solar powered. I'm very excited about this guys. This is not only for camping, this is for everything. This is for walking your dog. This is for even just cruising around, finding stuff at night, treasure hunting, whatever you want to do with this. It is solar powered, which means it's powered by the sun, no electricity needed. Solar is in, guys. It's in. It's here to stay. Look in that description box below, just like all my videos, for this product link where you can pick it up yourself. Anyway, here. Came in the packaging with some bubble wrap there. And this is by GRDE Company right here. And just a plain box here. And the light is just inside. But we do have on the back here, it tells you the inputs. And we have input is 5 volts 1A, output is 5 volts 2A, USB output would be 5 volt 1A, output power is 50 watts, and the power supply, guys, is 10,000 mAh right there. That should be probably for the battery. The power source would, would be the battery. So let's go ahead and open this guy on up right here. Again, just a nice, simple packaging. We have bubble wrap there to keep it nice, and we have... Guys, right there, boom. We have the light right there, guys, and we have the solar panel right there. Let's get to that in just a split second, but we're gonna get to the other stuff real quickly here. We have a little, looks like a little power adapter charging cable here, and this must be for, we have, of course, our USB on this side, but then a universal adapter here, and it does, very nice, guys. It comes with four different adapters there. So let's go ahead and take these guys on out. We'll get a close-up of what they are in just a second. But let me see if I can describe a couple of these for you guys here. Looks like we have an older iPod docking iPhone 4, 4S right there. And again, when I mean universal, they plug in like that, each different one. We have the Samsung all Samsung devices, I believe that is called the micro USB. So that always comes in handy. We have a very, very tiny one for who knows what, um, maybe Nokia phones or something like that. And then we have a regular, this one is typical with your GoPro devices, your Motorola devices, etc. Again, I'll get a close-up shot of that in just a second here. But you will need to get a adapter if you do use an iPhone. Unfortunately, it doesn't come with the lightning adapter, so just keep that in mind. But a lightning phone adapter should be very inexpensive. I'll try to link that as well below in the description box. But inside here, guys, again, we just have a little packaging there. We have our instruction manual right here, a little warranty card right there. Very nice, guys. Let me read a couple specs real quickly here. We have devices that are charged, of course, older iPad, your camera, your game system, your phone, your MP3 player, your Bluetooth device. We have a LED switch. We'll get to that in just a second here. Product size is 122 millimeters by 78 millimeters by 25 millimeters. Approximate weight of the product is 370 grams. It tells you how to charge it. Etc. Warranty service, like I mentioned, LED features, etc. Looks like the light becomes flash rapidly to send out an SOS. It is the LED with 30 watts of power. Casts a light bright enough as a T5 fluorescent lamp tube does. Wow, very nice. And there are two brightness levels available to meet different lighting needs as well as save electricity. Very cool, guys. Again, little manual there. So let's get right on into the device here, guys. I'm excited about this one. I'll be definitely putting this one to use here. So we have a little plastic right there. Wow, I think I accidentally turned it on and you can see how bright it was right there. That is very, very, very bright. So let's take a look here. And wow, okay, so there is the flashy. Look at how bright that is, guys. And we have the off button there. And so again, there's our button right there. So let's go ahead and cast it this way so you guys aren't blinded there. Wow, okay, that's the bright function. Very bright. And then we have the, okay, watch my face. We're gonna go down to the lower setting right there. And then we're gonna go to the flashy setting right there. Anyway, hopefully that didn't screw up the camera there. 
and then off. So three different functions in the button, bright, low, and then SOS or flickering so that you could find each other if you're camping and go, hey, I'm over here. So on this side here, guys, we're gonna get a close up to this, but again, we have the on and off button, so it's completely on, off there. Got some nice blue LED lights. Let's go ahead and hit that again. Those blue LED lights go off. That must be for the, so it shows us three there, which means I believe that's the uh, the power right there. Kind of shows you the power grade, so when it goes to two, one, go ahead and charge that guy. So let's go ahead and turn that off there. I'll get a close up of that in just a second as well. Again, we have, uh, oh, very, very nice, guys. Very nice. So, again, if you didn't quite understand what I was talking about with all the adapters here, guys, this is, again, a solar panel here. We have bright LED light here. But then you plug in your USB cable here, which it only came with one USB cable. But, again, you guys, you guys have your USB cables for your phone. Then you would plug in this guy right here, plug that into your cell phone device. So let me grab my iPhone here and let's go ahead and plug it in and let me show you guys exactly what that looks like here. But again, two slots, so let's get a close-up look. Alrighty guys here, we have my lightning cable plugged in already at the 2A output right there. But again, when I hit this on and off button right there, the bluey LED lights flash and it's kind of hard to see on camera there because they're pretty bright, but there is one, two, three, and four lights right there. My fourth one is off. But three are lit up right now, which means that the battery is about 75% charged, my guess. Again, our button right here for the LED bright, LED low, and LED flash. And then again, our another USB output for charging another product. And then our charging cable, you would charge it this way here. So guys, the cable that came with it, you actually can use that to charge your device or use that to charge a, another electronic device. As in charging the device, I mean recharging the battery pack as well. So let's go ahead and get a little shot of that real quickly here before I plug in. All right guys, so as we can see here again, that would be your charging cable to recharge the battery. Again, this side, very well constructed guys. I'm very, very impressed with this product. This is definitely a high-end product guys. So we're back over here on that side again. Our LED lights right there, coming over here, and I'm sorry, the box says 10,000, but it is actually 11,000 mAh solar charger with 20 LEDs. Very nice, guys. And coming over here to our solar panel, which is just amazing, which has a little protective layer on there. I got to peel up, and again, the company GRDE. I'll link again in the description box below. But let me just set that down real quick, and we have our lightning cable for our iPhone. So let me show you, we're gonna plug that guy on in right there. And after we plug it in, we just have to make sure the device is on. So we're gonna go ahead and hit our on button, make sure our blue LEDs light up. And then look at that right there, guys. We are charging, we are in business, my friends. So again, guys, I am gonna be putting this bad boy to use guaranteed. This is absolutely an amazing, high quality device right here. When I was mountain biking in Moab, Utah, guys, my phone ran out of battery. I would actually run into restaurants and charge up for like 15 minutes. But this bad boy, guys, is solar powered. I'm gonna be camping, backpacking, doing whatever I need to do, and staying fully charged. All right, guys, and this is what the cable looks like there. Again, your universal connector there to USB. And again, let me show you the different ones we came with here. We have a very, very tiny for like Nokia. And then we have, again, the micro USB for all your Galaxy Samsung devices right there. And that's actually your charging cable for recharging the battery for the product as well. And then we have, again, our Motorola and... For a GoPro, at least my GoPro, the 3 Plus, probably the 4 as well. I'm not sure about the sessions, but again, that is for GoPro or Motorola products as well, your Bluetooth connector, etc. And then, of course, guys, we have our older iPad, iPod, iPhone 3G, 3GS, 4G, and 4S iPhones as well. So, again, very, very nice.
Oh my goodness, I am actually very, very impressed with this product, guys. Look in that description box below to get your hands on this yourself. And guys, thank you so much for watching, and stay tuned for more unboxing and product review videos. You guys have a wonderful night. Take care. Bye-bye.